Good evening. Hello, David. Can you hear me? Hello, I am adjusting my computer. Good morning. Good morning. Good evening, sir. <laughs> Well, I, actually, you're right. Uh, it's yes, good evening for right you and, and good morning for me. <laughs> so no worries. <laughs> how was your How was your day, David? It's okay. It's uh, a busy day. I have class almost every hour. I I am busy, and I, I like because I. My day goes so fast. Yeah, yeah. That's that's um that's something very positive of of having a busy day, right? Because it goes by quickly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, how many groups do you have? I have uh, uh, five groups. Five groups. Five groups, and I give each one a uh, a uh, one hour class. Uh -huh. uh, uh, an hour of uh, 60 minutes. Uh -huh. Wow. And, uh, yes, all of the morning until uh, 1 o'clock. At 1 o'clock, uh, from 7.30 at 1 o'clock. Oh, wow. Okay. But you have like recess or something like that in between? Uh, almost nothing. Uh, I am uh, uh, sometimes I have a half an hour, but in the time I need to watch for the, the children in the in the in, he, in the break break. Ah. I, uh, yes, I, I I have busy all, all of the morning and um, we work until uh, we work uh, until three three p.m. Mm. and I only half an half an hour to eat and the day go fast. Wow, so you are, you have class until one, but you still have to stay until until three. Until three, yes. Ah, I see. Okay. I, I eat in half an hour, and then uh, the student have another class, but uh, not mine. But I, I need to stay there. there. Mm hmm. Mm, okay, I understand. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That that happens in in the in schools right because you have to also collaborate um, yes. and uh, help each other like even if it's not your class you have to also you know, yes. you're yes. right yes hello Jose Wilfredo hello teacher good evening good evening how are you so far so good teacher oh good 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 other day more other more day. <laughs> one more day. Yep, yeah, one more day. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Yeah. Are you are you at home? Hey, no, I'm living off my job right now. Mm, okay, okay. Yeah, that's why. And so, are you like um in your car right now, or I can't really yep. tell. Yep. Oh, okay. Okay. All right, I, well, I will drive to my to my home. Okay, okay, okay. Well, I, I appreciate you connecting, so thank you very much. No, okay, thank you, teacher. Um, you're welcome. And hello, Dora, how are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. Yeah? Yes. Mm -hmm. Good, good. I'm glad to hear that. Um, how was your day? Uh, very good. Mm -hmm. Oh, good, good, good. Okay, busy day? No, no much. No, okay, no. all right. So you, you prefer, I think you prefer the the not so busy days, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, good, good, good. I'm, I'm glad that, that um, it's working out for you. <laughs> okay, good, excellent. Let's see who else is there. Hello, William. Hi, good evening. Good evening. How are you? 
I'm good. Oh, good, good, good. How was your day? Uh, busy day. Busy day? A lot of things to do. Yeah. Oh, okay. I see. But um, it was good. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Good, good, good. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad things uh, were good for you. Um, all right. And let me see who else I have. Uh, Jose Marcos, how are you? How are you, teacher? Good, I'm good. Fine. Excellent. I'm glad to hear that. How was your day? Um, my day was kind of busy, but at the same time, I feel, uh, I feel relaxed and calm, you know. Uh, we have to to do it better <laughs> sometimes. Mm -hmm. So to the, tomorrow, I had the opportunity to to be more occupied. So I will do it. Yeah, my days are kind of sad because my classes. Yeah, oh, yeah my class. Your, your class yeah okay um we're broken oh your glasses yeah my... oh okay 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 yeah, i heard your glass your classes no no I, I i was gonna ask you if you were like studying at the university <laughs> uh, 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 okay uh, you you your glasses are broken yeah, yeah, and um, I have uh, like one month of since I um, since I got them. And and do you do you have like um insurance? Like, mm. can you go back to the place and and get them done again or something? Yeah, like that? I, I went. I went at the at the noon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and ask for the guarantee because the warranty 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 mm -hmm. uh, because one month of having uh, I think it's not it's not good quality so, uh -huh. and what did they say um, at the beginning they don't want to they, they told me that. Uh, the the warranty uh, doesn't cover that, uh, uh, like an, an accident because it, it was like I told them and they fall, so they broke it. Um, but not the, the, the glass, but the, um, I don't know how to say it. The frame? The arrow. The frame. Mm, the frame, okay. The frame, yeah. The frame. So, um, they don't want they don't want to to cover that accident, but I think it's not an accident because the letters always fall and it, it was the first fall that I have with that classic. So at the first fall, uh, they broke in. They were broken. I think it's not so the fr the frame broke. Yeah, the frame, the, the glass. Uh huh. The lenses, the lenses are okay. Mm -hmm. It's just the frame that That's the broke. Frame. Yeah, mm -hmm. at the beginning they want to to cover that, but uh, at the end they accept to to like um score the, the insurance or the warrant the warranty. Mm -hmm. So I I am waiting for the answer they. They can give me because they are planning like change the the frame or cut the the lens and put it in another frame. Mm -hmm. I don't know they're going to try. Mm. Okay. Okay. Well, at, 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 at least they uh, they accept that. It was, it was not my fault because 
not an accident. Like I was playing football or, or basketball, or or I had an accident, a, a real accident, mm -hmm. and I broke. It was a a, a normal thing that mm -hmm. I just fall. I think it's not. It, it was not fair that they don't um cover that insurance. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry to hear that. Well, hopefully, um, you know, they do they do actually give you um some resolution. Right, so to your problem. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, okay. Um, hello, Anna Claudia. Hi, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Good, good. How are you? It's, uh, it's hot here. I with the ceiling fan on because I don't know why. It seems like one of those days a previous hours before a big storms come up that it's not raining yet. So mm. it's the level is hot. Mm -hmm. But other than that, everything is okay. Running much... because is the last uh, these are the last days of the month. This is a short month for sales. So we are like running, making it everything we want everything happen happens like when a hurry <laughs> yeah um and um yeah yeah i can only imagine so what how 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 hot is it right now Do you know it feels like uh it says uh 29 degree but it feels like uh it says 26 but it feels like 29 <laughs> Mm. I don't know if you remember my room. Uh, my ceiling is uh, mm -hmm. concrete. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I guess that that is also what is happening. That uh, all the heat is like uh, accumulating <laughs> in yeah. the room. Uh, uh, that is upstairs, and, and then at night uh, during the day, believe me, this is the best room I can work in <laughs> because she's so. Uh, fresh the environment the, the atmosphere it's so quiet so nice but starting like around 6 p.m is like uh uh mm. it's the opposite but i mm -hmm. guess it's because of the type of construction of the yeah the you mean it's cool mm -hmm. not, not not fresh i'm cool. sorry i forgot it's cool exactly oh, it's okay. it's cool. <laughs> it's yeah cool. uh, well unlike you um, I'm actually a little bit cold right now, so I'm going to put my shawl on. <laughs> oh, how is the weather around there? Like, it's better. Uh... It's kind of much better, but still, um, I guess because it's, you know, it's pretty much the middle of the night. Oh. Um, it's because it's, it literally, you know, you, it, here it's dark. It's really, really dark. Even like when I stop, when I stop the classes at around, um, around uh you know 7 15 that i disconnect or something like that um that's when it's the the the, the sun starts to come out mm, um yeah it's just starting really? yeah mm -hmm. and um and, and it's it's earlier now because oh. when i just came um it was like it would start coming out at around almost eight o'clock mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Yeah, so it's a, but it's because it's it's winter, um, oh. and during summer, it comes out um, like around, yeah, almost like in El Salvador, like, uh, Six yeah, five 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 something five like five forty five six. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. And yes. There's no in winter in Istanbul. No. Oh, yes um yes yes um but the month depends, then, i guess it depends on the uh, on on the on on the year this year there was just very little snow um like 
there was like two days of snow, but it was like not even, it was not really snow snow. It was like ice water. Oh. And I remember in the morning when, when I, when I um stopped, when I finished the classes, I went to see and it was in the morning. It was, you know, I could see the rooftops with a little bit of snow. And then after that, um, like, like uh, later on in the day, it was like gone because it started to rain more. So, mm -hmm. yeah, it, so it's, it's not... a kind of what we get here when it rains with uh... hail. No, no, no. It's not exactly hail. It's hail it's... is the all those little ice. Yeah, yeah, balls. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. balls. Uh -huh. Yeah, ice balls. No, this is like ice yeah, water. <laughs> yeah, this is ice water. Mm. Uh, so it's like, it's como agua congelada. It's como, uh, it's, it, 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 like it falls, it, mm. it falls on you, on your, on you, and it, and it dissolves. It's like, mm. it, it just dissolves because it's water. Oh. So, you can see it, like like when it falls, you can see it, but then it just dissolves. Ah, okay. So at the end, you ended up like a what? Yeah, it, it's oh, wet, right. but you it's don't not have the the, yeah. the correct clothes, right? Yeah, but um, but it's not like rain, rain because mm -hmm. um, you don't it's get so wet. Water. Yeah, okay. it, yeah, it literally is ice water. Um, so it and it doesn't fall like rain, like rain, like like falls like that. But this is like it falls like a snow, so mm. it's soft. It's very soft, and it's constantly, I guess. Hmm? It's constantly, so yeah, mm -hmm. yeah exactly. you can get like two or one hour. Or so this type of rain let's say in that way yeah yeah like yeah yeah exactly and unlike in el salvador where the rain falls mm -hmm. and like let's say you know in el salvador when it rains hard mm -hmm. it rains for for like maybe one hour two hours mm -hmm. and that's it and then it goes away and then when it rains when it's like very like it drizzles it lasts the whole day here it's the opposite if it drizzles it goes away quickly but if it rains hard it rains like the whole day mm -hmm. so, yeah it's it's different <laughs> that is the reason why you see this uh a phenom phenom Phenomenos, what was this? Phenomenon. 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 Uh, phenomenon. I don't know how to say it in English. Inundaciones? Floods. Floods. Uh, Floods. Okay. Floods. I guess that's the reason why you see all these pictures. Uh, people floating and they are almost at the roof. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, because when it when it like for I I remember about two weeks ago, a little bit more maybe. Yeah, about about, about two weeks ago, um, it rained hard, hard, and that day I um, <laughs> it was I, I it you know it had to be that day that I went to a friend's house to go pick up uh, a luggage that I had left last time that I came because uh -huh. I, I came in June and um, and I had left a, a luggage at her house. And so um, I said, okay, so I'm going to go pick up the luggage. And, um, and then I decided to stay at her place. The next day, it rained, it like it poured. And, um, you know, I she dropped me off at the bus station mm -hmm. and I came um, and then I had to walk home um, okay. under the rain. And the problem is that here in Istanbul, the hills yeah. are, the hills, yeah, 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 they're like this, like 
Like mm-hmm. they're not, you know, they're not hills. Like I like ah uh, like if, if they're like this. Mm-hmm. So so the water was like running like a mm-hmm. river, and it, I got soaked. I got soaked. It was like because my like I didn't even have boots in that moment. So um, wow. yeah, my 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 feet were like wet it was like soaked there everything it was yeah but it was because of that because it was raining really really hard and it rained hard for like like I think the the whole day and and the next day too wow wow Mm -hmm. yeah yeah exactly well enough of that um uh let me take attendance Mm-hmm. Ah, there it is. Okay. Uh, Ana Claudia? Present, teacher. Right. Uh, David? Present, teacher. Right. Dora? Present. Right. Uh, Fernando? Fernando Ernesto? Fernando Ernesto? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Uh, Fernando Marvin. Fernando Marvin. No. Okay. Francisco Eduardo. Present teacher. All right. Wonderful. Heidi. Present teacher. Great. Uh, Iliana. Present teacher. Wonderful. Uh, Harvin. Present teacher. Excellent. Jose Marcos. Present. Wonderful. Jose Osmin. Jose Osmin. Okay. Uh, I can't see you. Is it possible to turn on your camera? Uh, yes. So teacher, now I'm going to my house. I just left the short that I was like in miss. Mm. But I'm going to my house now. Okay, can can you just Sorry. turn on the camera for is it as uh, just for the attendance and then when you get home you can turn it on completely? It's just that, you know, we it's Says me. Yes, I'm here. Uh, yeah, if you can just turn on the because uh, for, like for the the attendance, we need to have camera on. So just for the moment. Okay. All right. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay. Um. Eh, Jose Wilfredo. Present. Okay. Thank you. Jose Miguel. Oh, sorry, sorry. Juan Miguel, I'm sorry. Juan Miguel, no. Juan Miguel? Hello? Hello, Juan Miguel, me escucha? Hmm. I guess not, he's not here. Ramon, uh, Enrique? Ramon Enrique. Okay, not here. Uh, Roberto Luis. Roberto Luis. Roxana Ivet. Roxana. William uh, Alexander. Present. Okay, wonderful. Um, and Wendy, as well as Lima. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, <laughs> sorry, I forgot. Lima, I need to mention yeah. her. And Wendy. Uh, oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Bye. 
<laughs> Very good. And Wilfredo. Okay. And sorry, it's good. I know that Suleiman's not connected anymore, but I but officially I have to I have to mention her in the attendance. Okay, so um okay, so right. Um so guys, we're going to start our class. So please tell me if you can see my PowerPoint. You see it or not? Yes, teacher. Yeah. Okay. All right. So this is the advanced uh, four. It's um day fifteen. I'm sorry. No. Oh no. Sorry, guys. Sorry. No. I got the wrong one. Yes, sir. Okay. This is it. Okay. No, I don't know. He's done. Hold on. It's a kid buzzer. I'm going to try that again. Okay, that's it. Okay, so let's say advance number four, it's day 16. Um, the date is Wednesday, February 22nd, uh, 2023. And your facilitator is Jessica Guerrero. Um, okay, so we're gonna start with this right here. So it says pair work, okay? So we're gonna be working in pairs. Design a slide presentation to develop the following. Your understanding of the term of IoT. The impact of the IoT for the industry sector for which you work. The everyday application of the IoT in your workplace. Predictions on how the IoT can transform current processes at your workplace. And the, the most current threat posed by the IoT and you're gonna be rehearsing your presentation. How does that sound? Any questions about the aspects that you need to uh, present? No? No, not at all. Everything is clear. You understand what you have to be included in your presentation. Yes, no, maybe. Class? I like a reaction. Good or bad, doesn't matter. Guys and girls, it's clear. I see it's yes, clear. Okay, it's clear for you, David. What about for the rest of the class? Yeah, it's clear. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. And to help you to understand what you, uh, sorry, to help you understand. That's okay. Awesome. Okay, to help you understand um, what uh, what you need to do, um, we can you can use this chart. Okay, so here you can talk about what is IoT, how does the IoT, how is how does the IoT, um, it, how is it presenting the tasks that you do at work how the IoT impacts the industry um, you work for, your predictions and your concerns, okay? So something you can you can use to guide yourself, okay? 
Um, all right, so I am going to assign. Would you guys like me to um, send you the information or you guys, you guys already have it. I mean, you. I know you already have it in the book. Um, just so that you guys know what we're talk we're doing here. This is on page uh twenty, okay, page twenty. All right. Um. So I'm going to get you to work in pairs. So I'm going to sign in with your classmate right now. Okay, just hang on with me. A second, guys. I'm trying to figure this. Out. Hmm. Okay, I just want to make sure that everybody's here. Um, Kadvin, are you there? Yes, I am here, Tish. Okay, okay, good. Um, let's see, Kimas Novel. So, Wilfred, are you there? Will you be able to participate? So we're there. Okay, so I'm going to guess that's a new. Okay, just a second, guys. Um, Francisco Eduardo, are you there? Francisco Eduardo? T-shirt, oh. t-shirt. Uh -huh. Maybe Hi. my case is not able to do this activity because I am working, a, a little bit work here. And maybe at 10, I will be free. And I, I am we in the class normally. At 10? Yes, yes. But I am here listening right now. But at 10, we're going to be finished. At nine, sorry, sorry, oh, sorry. OK, okay. <laughs> sorry, <laughs> sorry. Right. no problem. OK, so Hadwin is not. OK, hold on. Let me try to figure this out then. Um. Creo que ya sé que voy a hacer mejor. Ok, para no confundirme, voy a mandar a todos los que no pueden a este grupo. Bien. Uh, Fernando Ernesto, are you? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Pues, de, de Marcos. Say, sí, okay, good. Okay. Estamos bien. Wendy? Ahí está, ok, entonces vamos a mandar a Wendy allá. 
Fernando Marvin, ahí está. Y William, ahí está, ok, perfecto. Dora is here. Ok, Dora is here. Francisco Eduardo. Francisco Eduardo, are you there? Ahí estaba. Ok, perfecto. Sí, está muy bien. Ok. Uh, ok. Okay. Um, all right. So some groups will have more than one person. Sorry, more than two people in the in in the group. But, but I think it's like the only way we can do it because there are some people that are not going to be able to participate. So I think it's the only way that's going to work. All right. So I'm going to give you um, about twenty minutes, and we'll see what happens after twenty minutes. Okay. Any questions before we go into the groups? Yeah. All right, let's open up the groups. Hello, Roxana. Hello, teacher. I'm sorry for the hour because uh, I was late. I was uh, working. Oh, okay. That's okay. That's okay. I'm going to assign you and um, and Eliana into a group. David, um, Hello, Dora. Can you hear me? Dora, can you hear me? Yes, teacher, I can hear. Okay, you. wonderful. Okay. Um, okay. So apparently, for me, it is unavailable. So just give me a moment. I okay. I'll be. Uh, just give me one moment, and I'll be back. Okay, Laura. Okay. Hi, teacher. Um, just give me, I uh, just I have a question. Just give me one moment. Okay. Um. 
Francisco, are you are you the air available? Yeah. Yes, right? Okay, so by accident, I got you guys, the three of you, in one group. So I'm going to be sending one of you to work with Dora because Dora right now is alone. Okay, so um, I'm going to send Ileana, okay? Okay. So Ileana, I'll move you with Dora. Just give me a moment. Where is she? Number five. Okay. There we go. Okay, go ahead. You guys can continue working. Hello, Rosanna. Hello. What about you? I'm tired. <laughs> I'm still working. Uh, you're still working? Yeah, I just changed my position because my computer for work. Hi, guys. Hi. Hello, any, any problems? Any questions? No, no, everything is here. Okay. All right. Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay. Um, all right, anything at all, you just call me over, okay? Okay. Okay, did you check? My computer is giving me some problems, but I am trying to open the the manual. It's not working at this moment, but uh, okay. The ah uh, now okay, yeah. It's open and. Uh, this one of the term of IoT what is the understanding what is IoT uh, this is the first one what we understand uh, IoT then what is the impact of the industrial sector Fernando. <laughs> Fernando, huh? Fernando. Uh, yeah. Huh? I don't have PowerPoint. I don't have PowerPoint. Yes. Uh -huh. so yes eh? I don't have problems in my computer. It's just the email. Just online. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yes, I have. I have office. Oh, oh no, I don't have office. Neither the one for nine. Don't have nothing in this computer. Okay, so it's a presentation of the. I don't know. You can make it the squares, and we are going to provide you with the ideas. Okay, like, like the example in the in the. You remember the those squares and one from. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm, like the example she sent. Uh huh. There are okay. understanding the impact, a uh, everyday application prediction, uh, the most concerning threats, and rehearse. There are five five things we need to find information. We need to add threats. Threats. Okay. The threats. most concerning threats. The one mm -hmm. we saw yesterday, mm -hmm. right? Okay, I will I, I, I share with you my, my screen. Okay. Can you see my screen? Yes. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay. This is the this is the, the manual, home, right? Yeah, this is the manual. Uh -huh. This is the homework, right? Number uh -huh. 10. Okay. If you want, can you write right in those squares? I think that is 
this is the the, the example the model right yeah mm -hmm. okay what we understand for iot what, the middle what is iot uh -huh. and then the iot is present in the exactly. test they do at my workplace but i guess you can you cannot write inside those right no no no, no. because it's but you can copy the, the, the format. Yeah. That is what they're going yeah, to do. Yeah, I copy the format, so. Okay, and the questions is, are the same. What is IoT? Can For you, us? Can you write a concept in your the own work? Things. Internet of Things is, IoT is Internet of Things. And our understanding of the term of the IoT is that all the assets can be can work together, connected through a, a network. Uh huh. Bye. So I'm going to write the concept that we made. Mm. O T. to another. Over or through, over the end. So what do you think about this concept with your idea and my idea? Mm -hmm. um, what is IoT? IoT have the purpose to connect and exchange data from one device to another mm -hmm. over the internet. And you saw through, through the internet. Through the internet, but with a help with a software. So. Yeah, could be through a system, a software, uh -huh. or you can exchange data. Um, Use a, a technology, yeah. any technology for for the AFP doing things. Yeah, well, at the end, it's pretty the same idea, I think. Yeah. But I don't, I don't know. You wanna add something else? No, it's okay. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, next part. The impact of the IoT for the industry sector for which to work. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, Facility takes takes is you know, order is a fast the 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 communication is fast improve the communication 
sector? How does the IoT impact the industry they work for? Mm -hmm. Okay. We can um, share some things that maybe uh, have in common uh, in our workplace. Mm -hmm. mm. The 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 tax is quickly. The the what sorry? The tax made uh, uh made quickly. Can you guys zoom in? Hello. Hi. Yeah, working. Any questions, any problems they're encountering? No, not by now, no. No? Okay. Um, is Ramon Enrique with is he working with you? Uh, Ramon Enrique, are you there? Ramon Enrique? Okay. Um, all right, any questions that you guys have? Oh, no. No? Okay. I, I guess that that's a meaning of the I of T in my work. Yes, but uh, oh. could be a share folder. Just share folder if the teacher uh tell us that we have to explain at uh, that point, we I can do it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh I don't know if uh, in your work, uh, do you have something like uh, IoT? Yes, uh, we work with that in the, all the time because we are teaching it. And uh, all of the students has their, their uh, devices that they need to access the platform that they need to to read the books, to read the words, to do quizzes. You ever Amazing. do application for a, uh, in your work, workplace, as a professor, yes. as a teacher? Yes. Uh, I, I did you when you, you were, I don't know if you are uh, making or teaching online. Or you have to, to go to the school now this year? No, the students are in the school. They are all offering presential way, but 
but uh, okay. we use the IoT uh, through smart TVs to ah okay to give them presentation and uh, to read to read the books. Every students have a, a devices a ah, laptop okay. a, 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 a tablet to read the books to do assignments uh, to do exercises. To, you have a projector, maybe, or ah, the TV, the TV you, you mentioned, the TV. Yes. Yes, I am. Uh, I don't know what is happening with my computer. I don't know if they... You guys need more time? Uh, we know, teacher, we don't, but the computer, yes. <laughs> 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 the computer this time, because I don't know what is happening. It's I, okay. I, I yeah, no, but, but um, okay, like, you, do you need more time to, to finish up your presentation? Yes. Yeah. Okay. okay. All right. Just just wondering um so that I can um give everybody more time or, or not. Okay, I think I lost everything because I don't have it. Uh maybe I can help you if you share the document with me. Okay, I will send you because I, I, I put it in the chat. Hi guys, I'm just wondering, do you need more time or is that good? Yes, it's true. I need more time. You need more time? Okay. Yes, it's true. All right, no problem. Okay. Hi guys. Um, just wondering, do you guys need more time? Now we're finished. No, uh, I guess no. You're finished. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, let me just go in and see the other groups, and if they need okay. more time, we'll we'll give them a little bit more time. Okay. So let's. I'm going to start. I'm going to start saying the what we understand, the blah blah blah, and then I guess goes to William, and then go. I think that we have. Uh, five, one, two, three, four. And also you said about the cost. Girls, how are you doing? Um, do you need more time? Yeah, teacher, please. Okay, yes. no problem. Last question. And I will answer in the first question. I will choose the industry of I only okay. I I only I don't understand the the final is the the most concerning treat also by the EOT maybe it's, uh, I don't know es como los escenarios escenarios no. um, um sorry guys concerned. just sorry to interrupt I'm just wondering do you need more time or are you guys ready uh, yeah, we need more time. Okay, no problem. All right, go ahead. Uh, so, uh, the most concerning free force by the IoT means that the, the thing you have to be worried about of the IoT. For example, IoT exposes users 
to cyber attacks or virus or uh, or malware mm -hmm. or, malware or virus mm -hmm. oh Uh, we have to. Well, right. that is the definition, but we almost don't have time to make it. And where do you know? I prefer the other sector. Ah. What is? We. If that is the, the the last word that you you wrote, right? Yes. The next uh, is the everyday application. Okay. Maybe it's the everyday application of IoT in your workplace. The can you? I, I write something here. The everyday application. Okay. okay. or an email service What is it now? The next to an platform. Can you see the book?
hip hop that you see this is also the other application that you see uh -huh. prediction how processing workplace that is the name okay I, I, I write this in the chat the okay. second part prediction on how the IoT can transform can transform what is it mean? transform current processes at the workplace current processes at the workplace Yes. That is predictions. Predictions here. There are there are. Because equipment. Yeah, equipment that relies uh, all, all equipment, all equipment that relies. Solo como tema, eh, as the, no, the topic. Right. In my case, in, in my work, eh, all the process, all the process running in IoT. You can type a uh, impact, just impact, and copy the the information. Where, 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 where? What I need to change? A R by Al. Al. Those. Al equipment. Oh. Right. Okay. In the, in the, Uh, what do you say? Como el, el tema, the topic. Porque no me si me refiero a la a la primera como la presentación. Here. Or in the, oh, like in like the 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 yeah. definition okay. in this case is impact. Just impact. Okay, you can type, um, for example, a application a uh, software a uh, sensor okay. 
but you can control that by your cell phone. Sorry? Well, the thing is that when you are um, talking about application, I imagine that you can use, uh, for example, your iPad, your laptop, or your cell phone to change um, maybe uh, some instruction for the machine. That's uh, right. Uh, the machine has uh, a many, many work, workstation. This workstation are computer that uh, have a specific software for mm -hmm. a specific uh, uh, a specific tax. Okay. Which one? Software? You say software? Sorry, I don't see. I didn't see very well. Okay. Um, the application, uh -huh. uh, or you can type a workstation, work station, workstation with uh, a specific software and erase the software in the Hi guys, I know that you're extremely bored, <laughs> but I, I had to give more time to the other classmates, okay? Uh, because they were definitely not finished, okay? So um, okay. You, you just have a little more time to to make sure that you you have the, the information covered, okay? Are you guys ready? Oh, teacher. No? No. Okay. Okay. Wait. No problem. The other groups are ready? Uh no, no. They're well, there uh, there's one group that is ready, but the others are, are still working on it, so it's okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. The other part, guys, is I don't know. Those predictions on how the IoT can transform current processes at your workplace. Mm. Predictions uh -huh. on how the IoT can transform current processes at your workplace. Ahorita, 
Bueno, la solo faltaría en que su finishing de la question. The most concerning three posts by the IOT. But uh, I think. Let me see. la industria en la que trabajo yo, pero qué chido es esa plantilla Sí, me tardé un poco. Pero está bonito. Sí, está bonito. Ah, ah. Sí. ah, ya estuvo las predicciones. No, pero. Uh -huh. Prediction of how can transfer current process are your workplace. But the operators and machine are transmitting data, data automatically in real time about in this uh, process. Mm -hmm. But how, how it will be in the future? Because it's a prediction. So does that um, IT You said to be improved and improve the uh, performance for our previous mission. Mm -hmm. Position of our Los lo procesos. Are you guys ready now? Almost a chair. Almost? Okay. Almost, almost, almost. All right. Like, okay, no problem.
Okay, so how the IT can transform current process of your workplace? Hi, Jose. Um, which group are you in? I, I, I don't know. I, that's why I, I came to ask you. I can't hear you. I'm sorry, teacher. I wasn't on that's, mute. That's okay. <laughs> I don't know why I was rejected. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, who are you working with, though? Uh, with David. And mm. okay. I don't remember. All right, I'll send you right now. I just, yeah, I didn't remember, so. Okay. Lo primero. Are you guys finished or do you need more time? Mm, finished, teacher. Sure. Yeah? Oh, wonderful. Right. Okay, perfect. I think just a uh, security breach. Mm. Security breach. Are you guys ready now? Or do you need more time? Yeah, teacher. Yeah, you're ready? No. Oh, yeah, you need more time. More time. Yeah, more time. Okay. Uh, three minutes. Okay, you oh. have about three minutes. Okay. We are ready, teacher. We finish. Perfect. All right. I'm going to give just about two more minutes to the other groups that are not finished, and then I'll see you guys in the main room. Okay. I think with the class one, with the dress and the prediction is you want. Okay, so I will start with uh, the definition. Uh, in presenting. And uh, you can uh -huh. uh, talk about the impact and application. Right. <sighs> Ok. 
Okay, definition, impact, application, prediction. When you are talking about the bridge and IoT, Francisco, what does it mean, the bridge and IoT? Okay, all right guys, so I think the majority of you are ready. So we're gonna start with group number one was uh, Jose Marcos, Ramon and Wendy. And we're ready when you are. are. Okay, okay. Okay, let me just share the first bit. Just give me a moment. So IoT in or workplace, who can inspire the usage of the IT in senior performance at work? Uh, first, the what is the meaning of the IoT? The IoT is the internet of things. So that uh, concept refers to a network uh, in, where devices are connected. Um, and the te also the technology to intercommunicate then with the cloud to send information and also they can collect information through a sensor or chip. So um, low cost sensor and chip allows the um, a, a lot of devices to, to, to collect information and daily use devices to collect information and send information. So all those devices uh, with that information and the cloud, the uh, information in the cloud, they can uh, like uh, make their performance smarter to the user, so they can answer in a better way. So that is the IoT in the you know, world. The impact in IoT. Uh, in this case, I choose the software development. Uh, industry. So for example, it is my my industry. For example, in this case, the impact of the IoT, for example, um, we can say that the IoT has bring that has brought a, a lot of new idea or innovation. For example, the project of a smartphone system. The user need the user and need to control or um, set the configuration of their lining, the heating or security system through uh, or from their app interface. So in this uh, phone smart system, they need advanced software. So new ideas uh, and the development of that idea um, have brought a uh, new opportunity for software development and new projects and all the industry. So uh, um, the next question is everyday application of the IT in a workplace. In this case, uh, uh, my classmate Wendy, Patricia, 
will help me with this with this part. Okay, thanks. Okay, I continue the uh, with the presentation. Um, uh, well, the lot work in text in textile industry, um, to collect data of everyday production, and so every product is recorded in the databases, and all information is sent in real time to 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 her headquarters in the USA, USA. Uh, to make sure the performance of each branch. In this case, is the, the this example is in my in my workplace because I work in the industrial in textile industry, and we have a uh, more applic application in the IoT in the in the work every day. And I continue the the next um, part is the. The most concerning the the how the IoT can transform covering the process in your workplace, and but the operation on the machines are transmitting data automatically in real time about industrial processes, uh, so the information is always available to measure in the productivity of the processes uh, so in the case of business decision is needed to improve to processes in the high level manager uh, because uh, they take a decision in the production or the uh, company in around the world and is the old teacher thanks uh, the, uh, uh, one question. the concern and threats posed by the IoT. Uh, we can we can finish this the slide, but uh, some threats uh, about the IoT uh, could be the hacker to steal our information because uh, the devices are connected to to the internet. So uh, maybe a uh, one hacker is like. Spying the network to 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 view the the traffic of the information, so they can steal like um, critical information. They can set or put a virus in the network and, and, and encrypt the all the information of any device. And they can check the or or like or um, identity and with the chef of information so this is all the this are all the the threats because the IT is always connected to the internet so it's like the 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 concept that we were talking about the the last class that, that is the, um, the the threats the security threats um, because we always are exposed to these threats because in internet, uh, not every system is secure, and mostly the the com the um, daily the home devices that we have that we use they don't have like um, advanced antivirus or system to to minimize the impact of of hacker or, or attack. So it's important to to be aware of this threat. Every time we connect a device to the internet or we have many devices connected in, in our local network. So that's all thanks for the attention. Okay, very good. Wrap it up. Excellent, guys. Thank you very much. Okay. All right. Let's move on to group number two, uh, which is uh, David and Fernando Ernesto. And Wilfredo, too, was added to this group. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Great. Perfect. Go ahead, Fernando. Okay. Let me share the presentation.
Can you see? Yes. Yes, we can. Okay. okay. I start. David, David, we the start with the presentation. Okay. IoT Internet of Things. How we understand we understand the Internet of Things or IoT is a system of interrelated computing devices that include mechanical digital machines and objects like animals like people that are provided with a, a unique identifier. And all of the scenes, all of these scenes, for that reason is scenes, all of these scenes need to have the ability to transfer data over a network. Maybe is uh, something like the uh, monitoring uh, the cardiac print or uh, uh, some health applications in the human body or something for control of the, uh, the animals uh, like uh, that worry that is uh, in extinction uh, or in danger of extinction. And the uh, they need to have the ability to transfer data over a network without requiring the human to human or the human to human or the human to computer interaction, like a sensors that are controlling the, the rain, the snow, the, the weather, the weather, sorry. Uh, and uh, that is giving information to a, a, a central system that is monitoring this information. That is our, our understanding of Internet of Things. The next one, how the impact of the IoT for the industrial sector. Okay, we choose educational field. There are uh, many sectors. Uh, Fernando work as freelancer and Wilfredo too, and they have their own impact, but we choose the educational fields. And, and it, uh -huh. In the, in the educational field, yeah. IoT has become yeah. one of the of the most important parts. Uh, uh, we can't conceive the education without IoT because we are communicating with the fathers through uh, chat applications or email. We are communication with the students through platform or uh, uh, we are giving the information to the kids even though they are in the classroom but uh, they don't are using uh, many uh, papers uh, many documents like uh, memorandums like uh, circulars like uh, but uh, all of that information is centralized in a in a website or in a platform and uh, every everyone can can read it. Uh, everyone, the, the the family, the parents, or uh, everyone is in charge of the students. And uh, if uh, an important part of the educational field, of the educational field, because uh, in the pandemic times, it uh, was accelerated because all we need to stay in house at house. The students, uh, the, the teachers, and all the need to stay at house, and uh, we need to use the IoT for continue the, the educational system. At home. Sorry. At, at, at home. home. At home. Yes, at home. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, thank you. The next one is for. I can I can explain this part. Yes, go ahead. Okay, the everyday application of the IoT. IoT are every part of the education task. So this is uh, related to the teacher environment. So 
uh, at this time. Uh, we can uh, communicate with your parent through a chat application or an email service that the student received their task and other assignments uh, through a platform or many books and other information are available uh, to the educational website. So this means like uh, some students uh, are uh, receiving their class at home. So uh, David explained us that uh, they uh, have a one, uh, one website uh, to communicate uh, some information, some important information uh, with the parents of their uh, students. And also uh, they have a, a access to, to explain something to the teacher, uh, to the students uh, related to the some tasks that they assign. So this is the, 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 the daily use for the IOT for for the for the teachers, so we can advance to the next slide. So, prediction of how IoT can transform current process at the workplace. There are some things like visiting museums, doing science experience, and working explaining. Uh, some math exercises will uh, be done in a virtual way. Maybe uh, the assistant, some kind of artificial intelligence, artif uh, artificial intelligence. So this means like when we receive uh, some uh, support of in a real life. So this means it's like when uh, maybe they assign one task and the student have some job about the task and, and the teacher has the ability, the availability to explain uh, something in a virtual class um, as we are here. So um, they explain uh, um, how to be completed and also uh, to uh, share some extra information to complete the task. Okay, uh, the most concerns threat posed by IoT devices. Uh, the first one is unsecured, unencrypted data, data storage. As we know, uh, we have a lot of IoT that uh, gets a lot of data. So that data sometimes uh, the, the major part maybe is stored in, in, in a cloud. So we are vulnerable with our information when it is in a cloud because it is over of control because uh, you maybe sometimes you pay for for a service like that but they, they have their uh, own security uh, systems equipment but you don't have any control of in that in that in that case you are you are uh, you have that vulnerability and sometimes, uh, for example, we maybe share information uh, when we we are connect in a free Wi-Fi, for example. <laughs> it's a it's a very common case when we are in a free Wi-Fi and we are sharing uh, maybe uh, sensible sensible data or important data, and you we we are in a free Wi-Fi. You are very vulnerable about it. Uh, Unsecure financial information. Uh, yeah, as we know, we, we have a lot of devices that can access where our financial information. Uh, sometimes it's very common nowadays in, in a, maybe e-commerce apps, you register your credit cards or maybe your accounts like a PayPal or another account like this. And that those applications uh, start your your information, your credit card, all the data for making any transaction like you want, but uh, that maybe is, for example, a, an app is is attacked by maybe a, a group of hackers. They can stun your information and can make transactions. And that is very common. That is because 
uh, it's a recommendation. If you you don't need, you don't save your credit cards in an app for making or buy some something. Uh, access to physical property. Uh, well, we, we have a lot of sophisticated system like uh, maybe smart houses or smart cars that they that use uh, a lot of IoT devices for security. But that that means uh, the, the IoT can be, if you don't have a, a good system security for that devices, a hacker can violate your, your security and maybe going go to your house and maybe it's with a with a, a device, a special device, or maybe a hacker can open the door and install all your possessions or, or install your car. That is a another threat with password and ID verification. Uh, the, the system when you you have a password for every system that you, you use, for example, your your account bank account, you see you want to, to go to the to watch your maybe financial information, you have a password, you have an ID, and it is it's for every maybe app that you use on they have your you fill a form in at the end you have to put a password. They had they, they, they want the password maybe be the, the most secure possible. And they have some rules like you have to put the uh, uh, uppercase letter, you have to put a, a number, a symbol. But for example, with our devices, sometimes that that is not a requirement. <laughs> Where for example, to you, I, I have some, some friend that made the, 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 the same. They put a easy password because uh, they, they, the, they didn't want to for, for God, forget the, the password. So for example, you, you can put one, two, three, or four, and that is a weak password. Uh, what, what is happened when, for example, you lost your phone or you lost your device with, with that password, that password. Uh, that is an easy, if you, if I can try the, the, that easy passwords, maybe I can unlock your device and access to information and that that all your maybe financial data, your photos, all your information. So it's very, very important to, to uh, put a, a good password in your phone or your devices. Uh, Botnets and mal malicious IoT devices. Uh, that is very common. Uh, we have to, to be careful with that because sometimes we receive maybe a message from WhatsApp and you with a link, you open the link only for may maybe watching the, the content for curiosity, curiosity, but that is is very you have to be careful about it. The, when you open the the maybe the link, you can you maybe are uh, uh, let it let it end, enter to, to your device or computer a malware or, or a spyware debugness and that is a, another uh, this list uh, we did get the list from uh, the top uh, top five security threats by IOTs in, in 2022 and that's it. Okay. All right. Perfect. Thank you very much. Round of applause. Excellent. Bravo. Thank you. Okay. Um, we have three more groups left, but because of time, we won't be able to um, hear all of them. So we'll leave that for tomorrow for the other groups. Okay. Um, just, but before we... Um, we we finish up. I wanted to um, share a few things. First of all, um, yes, yeah, so the word. Okay, so.
How do you pronounce this word? Textile. 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 Yeah, yeah. Uh, the last, the last um syllable, we pronounce it tile. So it's um, textile. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Smile. Okay. Just like tile. Um, you guys know what tiles are? <laughs> tiles. Just the word tiles. Any ideas? What are tiles? No? Okay. Tiles are um, what, like, for example, um, you can use uh, tiles in, a, like, the kitchen, for example. Um, sometimes in, at the, a, on the wall, you put tiles. Um, they're made, usually tiles are made of um, some sort of um, ceramic. Like, like, uh, like they are in the bathroom? Like, we put like in, in the, the bathroom. bathrooms? Yeah, ah, okay. in the bathroom. Yes, uh -huh. yes. Okay, so we, we pronounce it tiles. Tiles, yeah. Yeah. The, so, the little square. Uh, the little uh, squares, yeah. Bricks, yeah, okay. Yeah, that, that make it easy to, to clean <laughs> the, the wall. Uh, okay, yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes. Yeah, that's that. That's um, that's those are tiles. Okay, all right. And I know this word is very difficult to to remember because um, you know it's it, you know it's like like it's in Spanish. You know, you want to pronounce it like in Spanish, but it's it it we say day data, not data, data. Okay. Yes. That is the man in the inter enterprise, <laughs> in the movie. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. One, one guy in the movie is Dara. Oh, <laughs> maybe, okay. I didn't know that. maybe, maybe in English it was Dara, but we see the, the the movie in Spanish here in Salvador. But oh. maybe in, in English it was Dara, but in Spanish they say Dara. Maybe, maybe <laughs> I don't, I don't know. Okay, the yeah, next word is industry. Industry. Yeah, the stress is on the first syllable. Industry, not industry. It's industry. In mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, okay, I this one. Just be careful. I know that also we want to pronounce it like in Spanish. This is I O T, not E O T. Okay, IOT. This is great. When you ask for pupusas, IOT. IOT. <laughs> okay. Yes, IOT. Okay, I've got sense teacher. Sure, why not? <laughs> if that works, yeah. And the last one is uh, threats. 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 This threats. is difficult. Threats. threats. Mm -hmm. threats. Yeah. I know the T H R. That's that. Th 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 yes. th 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 right. That. So we got to practice threats. that. Thre thre threats. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. Threats. All threats. right. Good, good, good. All right. Perfect, guys. Um. So let's just, uh, before we leave, let's take attendance. Last time, uh, we'll start with Ana Claudia. Present teacher. Wonderful. Uh, David. Present teacher. Perfect. Uh, Dora. Present. Excellent. Fernando Ernesto. Present. Excellent. Uh, Fernando Marvin. Present. Excellent. Um, Francisco Eduardo. Present teacher. Excellent. Um, Heidi. Heidi. Okay. Um, Heidi was uh, here at the beginning of the class, right? Right? Yes. Yeah, right? 
I just dije, será que my play, my mind is playing tricks on me. <laughs> okay. Um Iliana. Present teacher. Okay. Um Harvin. Present. Wonderful. Jose Marcos. Present. Okay. Uh, Jose Osmin. Present teacher. Jose Wilfredo. Jose Wilfredo. Wilfredo? Present teacher. Okay. All right. Uh, Juan Miguel. Hey, our teacher. Wonderful. Uh, Ramon Enrique. Ramon Enrique. Roberto Luis. Your understanding of the term. Uh, Roxana. Okay, very good. Uh, William Alexander. Present. Wonderful. Uh, Suleima. Your understanding of Wendy. Your understanding of the term. Present. Okay, and Wilfredo. Okay, guys, um, so that's going to be it. Um, I don't know if you guys had problems yesterday with the platform. Um, did you guys have any problems with the platform? I don't know. But anyways, um, there was there there has been some um, issues with the with with the platform with the server so um that's why today i didn't um update the information uh from the platform because i knew that there had been some problems in the platform and i didn't want to affect anybody so if you haven't finished unit two and the midterm lucky you because you have one more day so i'm going to give you uh, up to today to finish that and tomorrow i'm going to update it because um yeah I, I didn't do it because i was aware that there had been problems on the platform so um just letting you guys know if you need you have a few more hours okay so that's it guys i will see you tomorrow oh by the way um today is roxana's turn okay so roxana eh, um i'll if you um if you can stay i'll be here to help you okay? okay so that's it guys take care see you tomorrow see you thank you good night good night, good night. Thank you, good night everyone <laughs> thank you teacher good night everybody good night All right. Um, hello, Roxana. How are you? I can barely hear you. Now? Yeah, a little better. Oh, okay. Well, everything is okay, but to be honest with you, I'm tired. Of Mm -hmm. I need to continue continue with my work because I need to check some some topic in, about uh, accrual provisiones. Yeah, accrual. A what? Accrual pro provisiones. Provisiones contables. Pro uh, provisiones are pro uh, provisions, but. Um, oh, approve, approve. Did you say approve? No, no. Es que de por de hecho la cuenta se llama accrued. Como accrued. Es, accrued. Oh. Pero no estoy segura que si se dice provisiones o provisiones contables ahí sí me. Por eso solo le mencioné la cuenta. Oh. That I need to check. Uh, I need to continue checking some uh, information in my work. Okay, all right. How about we do this then? Um, if uh, if you want to have your session later, uh, when we finish with the round, we can we can go ahead and uh, we can reschedule if you want. No, no. Are you, sh are you sure? Yeah. Tonight is done.
<laughs> okay. All right. Okay. Maybe maybe a little bit of break uh, from your yes. would be a good. Okay. It's okay. Fine. Yeah. Okay. Good. 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 All right. Um, how have you been feeling with the platform? Any problems that you've encountered? Well, in, in my case, that in general, that topic is um, maybe a little um, complex because it's more specific to IoT department. And maybe I usually use uh, the things or, or the activities, but I, to be honest with you, I, I feel like a little confused with some uh, terms. Okay. Yeah, you know, because it's different when you are talking that type of that type of topic with a uh, engineer, but in my case, it's accounting department. So it's totally different. But I like it. Uh, I was working at in the platform yesterday, and I understand uh, a lot. And I know that maybe the exercises are sometimes a little uh, easy and we need to look in for more information to try to complex more. But everything for me is okay. Maybe uh, in sometimes uh, I feel like um, uh, a little como perdida, lost. Lost. Mm -hmm. lost because lost. Uh, Sometimes I keep up with um, Fernando. Fernando, both Fernandos mm -hmm. are working in IoT department. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's a little confused because they uh, work in that type of, of terms. And I try to understand, but it's a little complex. I, okay, I understand what you're saying. Um, okay, so let's start by, you said that some terms and things are a little difficult for you, you're not sure. Tell me, what what kind of um, terms are difficult for you to understand? Well, Maybe I, I can was, help you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I was uh, talking with uh, Francisco today, and we were saying, what well, well, I was saying that, uh, for me, bridge is the same is the same as security uh, treats because you are working you are uh, talking about uh, malware phishing or something like that. For me, it's the same because it's um error in the security terms. Yeah, mm -hmm. so for me, it's the same. Okay, it's related, okay? Um, it, it's related, but it's not um, exactly the same. But yes, you you are right that, that they, they have many things in common, okay? Um, a threat is a possible danger. Right. Okay. So, uh, so security threat would be a possibility of um, of a danger in security. Right. Okay. So, um, so yes, the um, uh, so security threat would be um, a possibility of uh, of entering. A, um, a system because the um, the security code is not very um, is is very easy. Let's say, okay, that would that would be a threat. Okay, um, threats. For um, example, a hacker when they hacker. try to look for your information. Right. Exactly. Yeah. So that's a threat. That's a possible danger. Now. Mm -hmm. What happens is that some hackers, for example, um, they they literally break into a security system. But others, uh, other things that like if they're not hackers, 
what they do is um it, like what uh we were talking about with with uh, Anna Claudia yesterday i think it was that um she was mentioning that they what they want is for you to um to voluntarily give them the uh the possibility of breaking in so it's almost like you are the one who's giving you giving them authority to be able to get in how i'll give you an example um let's say that um but uh, do you do you work from home? Yes. Only from home. Sometimes. Okay. Do you go to the office? Uh, do you have a a badge from your office? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you have a badge. Let's say that I don't know how big your your how big your um your company is. But let's say that there's a lot of people working at the company and there's somebody that says, oh, um, you work here, right? Um, you know what? I'm so sorry, um, but I, I hate to do this to you, but um, I forgot my badge. At, and, um, and let's say you have to use your badge to get into mm -hmm. your workplace, right? To, um, to open a door say would you be so kind um you know because i i forgot my my badge at home and if i if i go back home to get it i'm going to be late for work and they're going to discount a lot of money so uh, would you be so kind just to let me come in with you and you say okay you're and you're a good person so you said sure no problem um mm -hmm. and so you open the door for yourself and you let the person in as well that's a breach you and just create you gave you you created you created a breach you created the opportunity this because literally what a breach is is like a gap in between um two things so what you've done is you created or that 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 opportunity um to or well the to for them to go in and that person could be somebody from your from your workplace, but they could also be somebody that is trying to um, do something illegal. And they have been able to find a way through in a legal way. They have not hacked into it. In fact, what they've done is they've uh, they've they've tricked you into giving them permission. It's so they maybe the same case when we are asking for delivery and we give the credit card information in the cell phone. So we give the, the credit card information, but only for that um, file. But maybe they can save that information and can use it for it, others. Yeah, except that um, it's it's like a way of it's like attaching it's it's a way of attaching a a, 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 a not like not a potential threat but a real threat into a security system okay. it's like it's a way of it's a way of getting into mm -hmm. but legally let's say it's it's um it, it's a it's a way to it's like when you give a permission in a way mm -hmm. oh, it's you know what it's almost like like when you for example click on a website because you're like you're curious about something you have created a breach because mm -hmm. that gives them a possibility of attaching something for example to your computer like a, a malware right that's a breach okay. does that make sense yeah yeah okay so like i said yes it's 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 very closely related to a threat mm -hmm. but a, a breach is is the way that you create a security um malfunction mm -hmm. 
Okay. I think that it's not the same because it, when you are in talking about that in trips, you always thinking in beetles? Viruses. Virus. Viruses. Mm -hmm. Virus. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. that's why I imagine that for me it's not the same. Right. But but it can come in different forms, it's not just a virus. A breach mm -hmm. can come in so many different forms. So mm -hmm. a breach is any gap, any gap that is left that is not secured. That's mm -hmm. literally what it is. A breach is any gap in any way that you have made possible for something not to be secure. So here is something like it's closed because it's secure. And anytime that that opens a little bit, that creates a breach. Okay. 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 All right. Anything else? No, for the rest, I think that everything is okay. Yeah. Okay. You sure? Okay. okay. Sounds good. All right. Um. In that case, Rosanna, I'll let you go back to your your assignment. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. <laughs> Are you going to be up all night or or what? Sorry. Are you going to be up all night? Like, are you going to be awake the whole night working on this? No, I just uh, working for an hour, I guess. Oh, okay. 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 So I'll let you get to that so that we you can go to bed as soon as possible. <laughs> yeah, okay. All right. Take care then. Have a okay. good night. Good night. Well, good day for you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you know what? Yes and no. It's just when everybody says good night, for me, it doesn't feel that bad because literally right now it's still night time. Like if I look outside the window, it's still dark. Oh, seriously? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. it's still dark. <laughs> yeah. So it starts to get a little bit light around 730. So in about 10 minutes, it'll start to get a little bit light. But right oh, now it's still it's still dark. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I imagine. <laughs> okay all right Roxana take care and uh, see you tomorrow thank you all right you too bye